I think it just brings everything to such a level where your, my approach and your approach to, to music and art will never be the same. Look, I, I write about my life. I didn't want to write a record about being a mother because I'm not because that's not the type of artist that I am right now. I'm I'm a, I'm a generally an upset and angry artist who's trying to find the good in some in some darkness and then usually sort of comes out of it feeling better, you know. And and um, so a children's album was not what was on the table for me. An album about about my mother dying. Um, and, and, and my life now and the loneliness of, of it sometimes and, uh, is really more up my alley. Um, that being said, the last song that I wrote, uh, Everything Wrong is what it's called, is about being, about being a mother. Right after my mother died, it was impossible to pick up the guitar and, 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 and sing and write a song because I would just end up on, in a puddle on the ground. So after a few months and being able to then finally pick up the guitar and be by myself and be in a room like I used to be by myself, um, the, the song All Your Clothes, which is a song about my mother no longer being here, um, was the first song. And, 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 it, and it's just me trying to talk to someone who wasn't there, you know, and, and, I, and I say, you know, um, can we pretend we're talking, I'll answer for you if you don't mind. And she had written the song Proserpina for the concert, which is the, you know, the most important song, uh, one of the most important songs, I think, of her, of her career. It's the last song she wrote, it's the story of Persephone. And it's also the title track to my record. And it's my, you know, I, it's the one cover on the record and I think it's probably the most important and the strongest song on the record. Mm -hmm. And um, she sang it and we all sang the choir part with her. And there's, there's footage of her on YouTube doing it. And it's clearly someone who is in between the state of, of life and death and on her way to being the goddess that she always was meant to be, you know. So it was, it was very intense. I mean, when you look at the cover, I'm naked on it, and, and it says, come home to mama, so it looks kind of like sassy. When you hear the song, it's like, not at all sassy. The song is the story of, of Proserpina, or otherwise known as Persephone. It's a, it's a mother calling for her child to come back, and it's why we have the spring, because Persephone comes from, from hell up to her mother half of the year, and, and then springtime arrives, and it's rebirth. And so obviously my mother wrote this song with the knowledge of what was happening to her, so that's very intense, but of course I think, too, she wrote it for my brother and I, too, because when, obviously when we hear her sing it, it's very powerful. Rosa, no.